Both the Titans and Mustangs coming off of week one wins, Bryson Oliver scored four times from Atia against Plainfield North. Just getting underway in this game, 70 seconds in in fact, and we have our first score. Kyle Mooney fakes the give to Oliver, dumps it over the middle, and Nick Dotson is cool with that through the seam, beats his linebacker, and he's gone, 44 yards, 7-0. Glumberg South looks to retaliate on its first drive on third down. Fitz Stadler rolls out and fires. This probably should have been picked off by Ron Edwards, but a stop is a stop. Titans kick a field goal. Next MV possession, pretty similar to the other one. Mooney slinging down the far sideline. He finds Chris King for 41 yards, one of his six catches for a buck 39. He come at the King, best not miss, 14-3. Later in the first, momentum starts to turn. Oliver loses the ball. Glumberg South picks it up in great territory, one of Oliver's three first half fumbles. The team switch sides heading into the second quarter. 6'6", Stadler lofts the ball into the corner. Great catch by Chase Daniel over his shoulder. Mustang's still up, 14-10. But heading into the first half, the Titans grab their first lead. Set up by this 25-yard run by George Hahn into Matia territory. Then Ryan Jancic finishes it off from seven yards out, 17-10 south into half. In the third quarter, the Titans try to get right back to business. Posted up at the Matia 20-yard line, Stadler locates Peter Pappas out of the backfield but the back can't bring in the sure touchdown. He gets his revenge, though. Later in the drive, 10 yards out, Pappas is good for the touchdown on the off-tackle run, 23-14 GBS. Then the power goes out. Lights take about 20 minutes to come back on, but after the quick delay, we're back to football. First play from scrimmage, the Titans are inside their own one-yard line, a perfect opportunity for the Mustang defense, but Ranzik has other ideas. 48 yards later, Glenbrook gets the pressure off and then some. Pappas keeps getting his curling out of the backfield. He stopped inside the five here, but he does set up a TD from Quinn Conahan, 30 to 14. South is feeling pretty good about itself at this point, but not so fast, my friends. Oliver has other ideas. With about six minutes left in the game, he saunters in for a TD. Two-point conversion good, but Tia down 30 to 22. Mustangs force a stop, and then with two minutes left, it's Oliver again. Two-point conversion, also good again. And just like that, we have a new ball game, 30 all. But Mattia leaves too much time on the clock. Titans matriculating down the field. Stadler finds Daniel. It's nervous time for kicker Henry Tarbox on the sideline. But when he gets on the field with 11 seconds left and the game on the line, the 24-yarder is true. Despite the furious comeback, Glenbrook South sneaks by Mattia. They hit hard, but we beat ourselves. It was it was all our fault, but they, they did hit us hard to make us fumble and stuff like that, you know, mistakes. We just can't make any mistakes, you know. We, we got to play a perfect football game, and we should be okay.